fans. It's good to be back again. Now listen, I, got, I had a great day today. Oh man. I went up to St George's Hospital there, into the uh, Cancer Care Centre, and I had my water blaster on me. I call it my water blaster because that's what it does. It goes around your body and blasts uh, all the rust off you, bits and pieces downstairs that are giving you trouble. So uh, I call it the water blaster. And my time that I do it is called blast off time. Okay, I met a fellow there by the name of Bill Bishop. He's a namesake of my brother. And he's a vet in Christchurch. Uh, I interviewed him, on, put him on the video, and he spoke and told, told us a few th things about himself. So you'll hear uh, uh, from him later on. Then I went and saw the nurse uh, and got my blood pressure taken and my pulse. Uh, and it's fine. It's 150 over 92. Um, Anne is the lady there and, and I interviewed her and she told me what she did there uh, so it's all adding to the video that I'm doing now on the way home the devil tempted me to go into the pub he said go in that pub might be some good food in there so I went into the pub and there's all this beer and I said, well, I can't have a beer because I'm not allowed to drink beer. But the devil said, go on, one won't hurt you. So I ordered a low alcohol beer, thinking I was going to get a little glass, but they gave me a big glass. And I haven't told them yet. I'm going to see what happens tomorrow. But on the way home, I knew something, had, a drunken something, because I could hear the rumbling behind me. When I got down the street, I went into the supermarket and I thought, well, I'll buy my tea. So I went in there and I spotted a big flounder. Now, I love flounder. And flounder is good for people with prostate cancer. So I bought it. I got some uh, other few bits and pieces to go with it. And I come home. And I sat there with my flounder, my two eggs, my potato salad me lemon muffin, and I had a wonderful meal. And then I discovered something very interesting, and I'm going to take you and show you now what I discovered. Come with me into this little room here, and around the corner, and what have we got? A little throne. And above the throne, what have we got? A ball cock. However, there's something missing. No ball. The ball is now in the cock. Brand new ball cock. All in one. And that is what my prostrate is going to look like when I get it fixed and get the rust out of it. Isn't that exciting? 